hollyscoop.com exclusive in 10 seconds tell everyone why they should see this movie because it's hilarious and um we did that in two seconds and <laughs> also it's in 3d mm. so now it's in 3d and it's hilarious and there's a lot of poop pee and barf going right in your face yeah definitely <laughs> <laughs> um what why do you guys think that people love to see you guys act like jackasses I think, I don't know, I think they like us at the end of the day. They like the stunts and the pranks, but I think they like us and they can tell we're family and we give each other hell, but we love each other and, mm. and they feel horrible about throwing 200 snakes on BAM. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I don't know how you dealt with that. That was horrible. Yeah, I, I never fainted before, but I, I was pretty much on the verge of doing God, that, that would have been oh. gold. Oh my God. To bury I, I just, you under snakes you know, after like you fainted. <laughs> From trying to climb out, I was like running out of arm strength, yeah. and I'm watching more and more snakes land on my neck, mm -hmm. and they're falling in the pit, and I'm like, I cannot let myself go from this bar. But like, thank God, Dunn came in; he couldn't take it anymore. Yeah. Like, he felt for me too bad and pulled me out. He took it a while. I know. <laughs> Definitely, I was like, they need to get him out of here. That was now. that's my worst fear ever. That something yeah. that that and it and it happened. Oh my gosh. So other than that, what was the craziest stunt you guys did? I don't know, they're all kind of silly. <laughs> they're all kind of <laughs> crazy, you know. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if we have a good barometer on what's crazy or not. Uh, I'd have to give it to the Invisible Man, which is, uh, you know, that we, we painted this tropical oh, yeah, background yeah. and mm -hmm. then we painted him exactly oh like gosh. the background. So when you go like this, you, you the only thing you can see is his face. Yeah. Okay, so, that's painted too. Oh yeah, though, that so is actually yeah. painted. So, they and he's a Spanish bull mm -hmm. that's, you know, until he gets spotted so he can hit him and make him fly up in the air. Oh it was tough to spot me though, because I go, oh no, oh no. <laughs> Did you really get hurt? Because in the replay they show your neck or yeah, your face getting Yeah, I got a concussion. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Was that like the worst injury on the, in the whole movie? No, no. I had a broken clavicle, three broken ribs, a mm -hmm. busted kneecap and foot. And you're all healed now? It's all healed now, okay. yeah. But uh, wow. but the worst part is only only one or two of the things actually made it to the movie. Oh no! <laughs> the other ones will be in 3.5. Oh, okay. Sorry, bro. <laughs> so, <laughs> so there's a lot of stuff going on with bullying and things like that. So um, were you guys ever bullied in school? And what do you, how do you think people should deal with it? Punch them right in the nose. That's that the works. best way to deal with a bully, man. I hate bullies. Mm -hmm. I have a real problem with bullies. I've had three guys just get in my face and like, let's go, let's go. And oh I know I'm going to lose, but I always, uh, I, and I lose. But I hate bullies. I think it's just awful. Mm -hmm. Bust them in their nose. How about you? Ever been bullied? Uh, did, you see, did you see Jack S 3D? <laughs> well, <this laughs> Other than that, of course. <laughs> no, it is true, though. If, if you just go for it and, and start punching the bully in the face, whether you're gonna lose, he's gonna stop picking on you, you know? Never, yeah, it's like never pick a fight with someone you can whip. Mm -hmm. If you're gonna pick a fight, pick it with someone that's gonna kick your ass, and then a lot of fights won't get picked. Well, oh. I tried to do that with a seven foot tall dude, and I still have this mark, because I lost terribly. Yeah, or beautifully. <laughs> beautifully. Um, so Halloween's coming up, are you guys gonna be dressing up? Uh, I don't know. I don't have anything planned. Are you dressing up? Well, apparently we're going to Europe, so um, we're gonna be dressing Why? down. And I, uh -huh. well, the thing is, when I travel, I never bring any luggage at all, except for oh. my iPod, iPod and my phone. That's all I bring. Wow. It, actually, I've seen you on a flight with dressed completely down, wearing nothing at all, right? No, or did you have your pants all the way down? You know, is, was it on the thing where you just, everything was hanging out? I remember the footage. I just don't like to carry things when uh, I travel, yeah. so if this shirt gets dirty, I'll throw it away and just get another one. Mm -hmm. He doesn't like to carry things like those itchy pants, which like he'll the, throw off in yeah. a second. So I won't oh have God. a costume.